Welcome to this Deep Lizard series where we deliver bite-sized, practical, and intuitive explanations for the most common terms and concepts in the field of deep learning. I'm Mandy, and the topic of this episode is computer vision. The field of computer vision is one in which the application of artificial neural networks has been made extremely popular and also has proven to work extremely well. Computer vision is involved with enabling machines with the ability to work with and understand visual data, like that of digital images and videos, for example. We can generally think about this as giving machines the ability to have a visual system like that of humans. In other words, computer vision is involved with enabling machines to see. As I'm sure that we've all come to realize by now, Data is an asset, both personally as well as to companies at large. We now have loads of data uploaded to the web every day. A large portion of this data is indeed digital image and video data. To be able to make use of this data, we, or whoever wants access to it, must be able to analyze and process it. Having humans analyze and process all of this visual data is not only tedious and efficient, but also likely impossible. This is where computer vision comes into play. Computer vision is used greatly in various aspects of the analysis and processing of visual data. Outlined here, we have various different computer vision tasks that are common practice today. All of the tasks listed here have made great strides through the use and application of deep learning algorithms or artificial neural networks. With the first task listed out here, we have image classification. In deep learning, we can deploy an artificial neural network to an image classification task where we pass images to the network and the network is able to classify the images into predefined categories. Similarly, with object detection, we can identify predefined objects within an image using artificial neural networks. We also have image segmentation, where a neural network can partition an image into predefined segments. And finally, we have the task of image generation. This is where we use an artificial neural network to generate images based on some predefined categories. Now, these are just some of the tasks that fall into the broad category of computer vision. And specifically, these tasks have been proven to be implemented well through the use of deep learning and artificial neural networks.